How's it guys? If you've been working on Premiere Pro and you found this error, warp stabilizer and speed cannot be used on the same clip. It can be quite irritating. And if you don't know what to do, I'm gonna show you how to fix it. So let's jump straight in. Okay, so we're in Premiere Pro and we've got our two clips. This is just a handheld shot I found on Envato Elements and it runs into a second clip, which is that one over there. Let's say that we wanna speed this clip up because it's too slow. So we right click, click on speed duration and uh, let's speed it up to 250% just for the sake of this tutorial and we put it together like that this is what happens first clip is fast going into the second clip now the problem that arises when we do this effect and we add a warp stabilizer to it is we get that little error in the bottom corner which is very irritating if you don't know how to get rid of it i'll show you how i'm just command z to undo that very very simple all you need to do is right click on the clip that has your speed changes which was the first one i changed the speed and the duration on that one and you just simply click nest you can give it a name if you want i'm not going to do that basically what that does it takes the effects that were on that clip and it merges it into one separate clip what premiere pro struggles with is putting warp stabilizer on top of foot that already has some sort of scale elements or speed so what you need to do is make sure that you nest it to make it one separate clip and now I can drag my warp stabilizer onto that clip and there you go it has analyzed it if I play through you can see there's no more error and that's it I hope that helped um, if it did give me a like subscribe to the channel uh, cool guys uh, see you around peace out